after 31 men were arrested for conspiring to riot at a Pride event in Idaho, the LGBTQ plus community in Butte were shocked to learn there were complaints about the rainbow flag being flown outside of the Butte Silver Bow Courthouse. We've seen that people were concerned about our pride flag here in Butte. Some people felt that it wasn't appropriate to display. Doug Ingraham is a vocal member of Butte's LGBTQ plus community and heard through one of the state representatives there was concern about the pride flag in front of the Butte Silver Bow Courthouse. Those uh, colors are, uh, are in those representations are things that anybody in our community would be proud to represent and I don't know how anybody could be against those. Chief Executive J.P. Gallagher says that Butte Silverbow is a community of inclusion and hasn't received any complaints directly sent to him about taking down the rainbow flag. We feel very uh, strongly that it, it's important for us to show that we're, we're a community that is diverse, that uh, embraces all and that um, you know it, we're not going to we're not going to give in to the pressures of, of people thinking that that it shouldn't be flown. According to ACLU Montana, Butte is among only five cities in Montana to pass non-discrimination ordinances. Butte became the third city to pass a non-discrimination ordinance in early 2014. The ordinance bans discrimination based on sexual orientation or gender identity regarding housing, employment, and the use of public accommodations. Other cities that have a non-discrimination ordinance are Missoula, Helena, Bozeman, and Whitefish. For now, the rainbow flag will continue to fly with the other flags in front of the courthouse. This is the second administration to fly the flag, and we're really proud of what it represents and the unity it brings to Butte. In Butte, Caitlin Aguilas, MTN News.